So this is interesting. I've done this maybe 10 times and there's the trail. Uh, looking back this way, back into the sun, there's a little bit of snow back that way. Not that much. But uh, over in this direction, I think you can see where they've carved across the snow. Uh, don't know how deep that is. Well, I've never seen that much snow up here. Of course, I don't usually get up here this early in the season. I'm guessing that all you can hear is the wind. It's very breezy. That's Frozen Lake. It's as frozen as I've ever been up here and seen it. I'd say it's about 80% still frozen. <laughs> On a day like today, it'll melt. Alright, again with the wind noise. Here's the trail I'm going on. I'm not sure if you can see it. It slices across up there, across the, uh, that little mountain. And uh, the trail I like to do is around this way, towards here. This mountain burrows over to the right. You can barely see it, but the trail runs right across the slope of that snow. This is about my closest <coughs> spot to the mountain. I've gone up around that slope, done most of the climb. There's, there's a nice view. And if I tip it over, you can kind of see how high I am. Okay, back in the wind again. Um, if you can see the trail, it runs down there, but then the actually the end of the trail. We're ended at the end of a long ridge line that juts out in a way. I'm turning around now facing back the way I came. There's the mountain and then this is uh, Fremont Lookout which was an old um, forest service uh, lookout for back when this is how they look for forest fires. I don't know if you can see that. There's a little chick not running, running by. There's been several on the trail. He's very friendly. He's going to come over and say hi. I'm not sure if you can see him. I can see him. So, I guess it's time to turn around and head back. 